Hi everyone, my name is Iman and this is the Iman Global YouTube channel. Welcome back to another AI tutorial. Please support my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get started. The images you are seeing were all generated by the Flux model. As you know, in today's world, with AI-powered image generators, commonly referred to as art generators, We've reached a point where you can transform your ideas into stunning visuals simply by using text commands. Recently, among the wide variety of image generating models, a revolutionary new model called Flux was introduced and released. It has surpassed many advanced models in generating images and has truly transformed the world of AI-generated imagery. The new Flux model has gained the admiration of renowned artists worldwide. Experts believe that the development of Flux could even become a viable alternative to Midjourney. Flux represents a major leap in AI-powered image generation. The technical architecture of Flux is a masterpiece. It offers a powerful platform that understands complex commands and converts them into highly realistic images. What's particularly impressive is its excellent performance in analyzing text and accurately generating letters and words, which sets it apart from previous models. The Flux model was developed by the Black Forest Labs team, and you can even spot traces of the major stable diffusion project within Flux. In my online searches, I discovered that Black Forest Labs has officially announced its presence by launching a website. On this site, the Black Forest Labs team states its mission to develop and advance cutting-edge generative deep learning models for media such as images and videos. Their goal is to push the boundaries of creativity, efficiency, and diversity in the field of generative AI. By visiting the Our Team section on their website, you can see the names of the individuals who are part of the Black Forest Labs team. On their website, I also found out that Black Forest Labs is currently working on a major project titled Text to Video. They are promoting their next project under the slogan State of the Art Text to Video for All. Flux is part of an ecosystem, not limited to a single model. It includes a family of models, with different versions like Flux Schnell, Flux Dev, and Flux Pro, catering to a wide range of needs, from casual users to advanced industries. Flux Pro is the most advanced version of Flux, offering cutting-edge performance in image generation with top-notch prompt-following capabilities, exceptional visual quality, detailed images, and diverse outputs. This version is commercial and not open-source, suited for professional and commercial applications. In addition to high-quality image production with precise details and diverse outputs, it also offers dedicated support from the Black Forest Labs team and custom solutions tailored to companies' specific needs. You can access it through API purchases on platforms like Replicate, Feld.ai, and Mystic. Flux Dev is designed for non-commercial applications, distilled directly from the Flux Pro model. It provides similar quality and command adherence capabilities, but is optimized to be more efficient. Flux Dev is perfect for developers and researchers who want to experiment with high-quality image generation without engaging in commercial use. It is free and intended for troubleshooting and enhancing the main version. Flux Schnell is the fastest version of Flux, tailored for local development and personal use. It's openly available under an Apache 2.0 license and can be accessed through various platforms, including GitHub making it easily accessible for users who need quick and reliable image generation on their personal machines. It delivers excellent performance for those focused on speed. Completely free, this version is ideal for users prioritizing high-speed image generation in local environments. The images you're seeing right now were all generated with the Flux Schnell model, which can produce a wide range of styles, from realistic to anime, cartoons, and more. Based on what I've shared, are you interested in gaining access to the Flux model? Would you like to create images similar to the ones you're seeing now? I have good news for you. In this tutorial, I will show you how to access Flux and generate images in its various styles, for free and without any limitations. Here's my surprise for you. The Flux Schnell model is now available through the Paclumen website. This website allows you to use Flux Schnell for free. It's crucial to note that at the time of this tutorial, using the Flux, Schnell model on the Paclumen website is completely free and unlimited, but I can't guarantee this for the future, there might be restrictions added later. So don't miss out, join me and don't skip this tutorial. By the end, you'll be able to bring your ideas to life, transforming your dreams into reality with text commands and the Flux Schnell model. Let's check out the Paclumen website. 
As mentioned on the site, Piklumen is a free art generator. A little scroll down, and you'll find an enticing message that says, Try the Flux model for free. This definitely gets me excited to explore further. To get started, you'll need to create an account. Click the Launch App button on the top right corner of the website. On the sign-in page, you can either use your personal email or a Google account to sign up and log in. Once logged in, you'll be taken to the Explore page, which is essentially a gallery of images generated using Piklumen's art generator. It's continuously updated with new creations from users. Clicking on any image opens it up in a new window where you can view it in a larger size. You'll also see the prompt used to generate the image, along with details like the negative prompt, image dimensions, and the specific model used. There's even a download button, so you can grab your favorite images for free. The Piklumen website is available in different languages. To switch the language, just go to the menu at the bottom left of the site and choose from options like Spanish, Italian, Portuguese, French, and more. Your username is displayed in the bottom left corner of the website. If you click on the three dots next to it, a drop-down menu will appear. From here, click on Usage Dashboard. Here, you'll find image generation statistics and an interesting feature called Fast Hours, which affects how quickly your images are generated. Basically, you get 0.5 fast hours per day, which resets daily based on GMT. During fast hours, your tasks are prioritized, and if you run out, your tasks may take longer. But don't worry, there's no limit to the number of images you can generate, even if your fast hours run out. Now, to generate images using the Flux model in Piklumen's AI Art Generator, click on the Create option from the left menu. This takes you to a page where you can see a gallery of the images you've already generated. At the top, there's a text box for entering your prompt. Now for the main surprise of this tutorial. Flux is one of the newest and most amazing image generation models, recently launched by the Black Forest Labs team. It has incredible power in creating images. Flux comes in versions like Pro, Dev, and Schnell. Through the Piklumen Art Generator, you have access to the Flux Schnell model for free to generate your images. Above the prompt box, there's a drop-down menu for choosing the image generation model. I'll select the Flux Schnell model from the list. The prompt is basically your ideas and dreams typed out in text form. The more detailed your prompt, the better the AI understands and converts it into an image. For this tutorial, I'm going to generate an image of a movie superstar. I've already written a prompt, so I'll just paste it into the text box. The next drop-down is for setting the aspect ratio. You can choose whether you want your image to be square, portrait, or landscape. This is super helpful if you need to tailor the image dimensions for social media platforms like Instagram, TikTok, or video platforms like YouTube. I'll go with the 16 to 9 aspect ratio. After that, you can choose how many images you want to generate, with options ranging from 1 to 4. To the right of the prompt box, you'll see an auto-translate button, which means you can even write your prompt in your native language and it will translate it to English. There's also a Prompt Enhance button, which helps improve the image quality by expanding your prompt, but it might slightly reduce accuracy. Once you've set everything up, click Generate. My request goes into the queue, and after a short wait, the text-to-image process using the Flux Schnell model is done. The image thumbnails appear, and let's take a look. I've generated images of Arnold, and as you can see, the Flux Schnell model really captured the essence of Arnold and the Terminator movie, producing some impressive images. You can download your images for free by clicking the download button. Now let's try something fun. Hover over one of the Arnold images, and click the three dots. A list will appear. From this list, select Remix. Using the Remix function, the same prompt and settings I used with the Flux Schnell model will be applied again for the next batch of images. Click Generate again, and after a short wait, new images of Arnold are ready. Thumbnails of the images appear, so let's review them. To delete these images from the gallery, hover over the thumbnail of any image, click the three dots, and select Delete, followed by Continue. This is how you can remove images from your gallery. Now, I want to test Piklumen's AI abilities in generating images in a 3D cartoon style. To do this, I'm going to ask Flux to generate a happy, smiling image of Dwayne Johnson. I'll enter my prompt in the text box, and as you can see, I've included the keywords 3D cartoon style to help the AI understand my needs better. 
I won't change the previous settings. Flux Chanel is selected, the aspect ratio is set to 16 to 9, and I'll generate 4 images. Click Generate, and after a short wait, my images of Dwayne Johnson in a 3D cartoon style are ready. Let's check them out. As you can see, Flux did a great job, the image of Dwayne Johnson looks realistic, and the AI accurately captured his smile as I described in the prompt. If you're not happy with the results, you can repeat the steps to get better outcomes. Hover over one of the Dwayne Johnson images, click the three dots, and select Remix. Click Generate again, and new 3D cartoon images of Dwayne Johnson are ready. Let's review the thumbnails. Now, let's push Flux Chanel's limits, and see how well it can generate images in a cyberpunk style. I've already written a prompt, so I'll paste it into the text box. With the same settings as before, I'll click Generate. After a short wait, the images of a sports car in a cyberpunk city are ready. Let's check them out. As you can see, the Flux Chanel model did a great job again. The cars look sporty, and the cyberpunk style matches exactly with my prompt. Now it's your turn. Was the Flux Chanel model impressive to you? If yes, why not hit that like button? Smash the like button and share this video with those who could benefit from it. This video is just a tiny drop in the ocean of tutorials I upload to this channel. If you're looking to learn more, you've come to the right place. Subscribe now and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future videos. Remember, AI is the future, so embrace it now. See you in the next tutorial.